Chapters DH. Chapters. We say we should do mute technique. How to play guitar mute technique. Uh, mute technique goes with a whole lot of uh, dimensions. But at first, you have to understand exactly what you want to do. When we say the mute technique, the name implies to it mute. You have to mute the strings. So we have different different formats of playing the mute. So as you are seeing, we have the soul note. This one I'm playing it key E flat. Either here in the C shape, in the D shape here, G shape, sorry, A shape, and the E shape. It depends on where uh, you want to play it. But let me choose. Okay, let me choose the G shape here for this one. So here we have do. A note I've time it I've named it myself a neutral note or a middle note that is the so a fifth note some others will call it power chord or power note playing do a zoom so here I can choose to play only the zoom So you see, I've cut mawa domono, mawa domono, mawa domono, mawa domono, mawa domono. So you see, I do not press, I press fully, I press halfway. So if I want to sound like, I can bring the plectrum to the the bottom part. To sound high, I want it to sound heavy. You see, you can see that we have the different notes ranging from here until you reach the bottom part. Everywhere I play, the tone is different. So, you see, we have different tones. So, here. I can play only the soul or rest on the soul. Oh. So my concentration is on the soul. So, 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 so that whenever I play the far, so, do. So my concentration is on this one. Oh. That is do re do do re do la so do re do la so. So here, as for the picking uh, mute technique, you have to be disciplined on the right hand. Ringing, your ringing must work. 
Top down, top down. So let's do that. first so here uh, you see I've done the one that we can stand on one note that is so it's better to stand on the so to avoid this chord it's not anything but maybe uh, you not get the chords correct but you want to play it part of the guitar or you want to play the guitar on stage you have to create something for the so either rest on the so That maybe we are playing. Also, you see. So I'm creating some party for the song from the song. Sometimes we manage the chord or the time. So you are creating exactly what you want the mute to be. Sometimes you go with the time or the kick. You play on the top on the kick. So in the next lesson about the mute, I will do a beat or I record a beat or a common beat so that I will play. For us to know the timing I'm talking about. Either you play it on the time or the time you play. Ka, boom, take a take a take a take a take a take a So that kick, I'm talking about the kick. So either we play it on the kick or we play it off the kick. Or sometimes you will listen to some songs, you hear that uh, maybe uh, from Yasapon uh, of Asmeni, uh, Amachi Dede, it depends on the genre. But the main thing you have to know is that either it, it plays on the kick or off the kick. It depends on the player, how he played it. So uh, this is the uh, beginning or the introduction to mute technique. Sometimes too, you cannot just play only, it may be so, so you make good use of the only so as time goes on, you have to follow the chord. So, or, you see any note within the chord, being one, two, three, four, or five, it depends. Mama, do see so? Oh, you see? Yes, see? You ready? Mama, do see? So you see, I followed. I followed the course. You ready? Then I go to la. To play one man, so it's not playing from down to top alone. Sometimes you can play from top to down as well. So, my wadum, yeah, you can see. Down. Casey, my 
So sometimes too, we run it like a solo. It's like playing solo, but we don't play the nose like Like I'm playing the solo. There is difference between the mute technique. And we have half mute. Sometimes you will play it like you are playing as if you are playing, as if you are not playing. So let me mix the two. Half mute. So like, no, it's not like. So you see, this is full note. So. So you see, I've mixed the two together. So as for the mute technique, I want you to try your hands on these forms that I've done. I have created one on the so 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 as for the so I say it's a neutral note but sometimes I don't want the student to learn the neutral notes because if they learn the neutral notes or the neutral note they will be lazy listening to the song just playing one or if only one note can help me play the guitar how should I worry myself going do la fa so and other chords so they will be doing this So he, the person will be just standing on one chord, doing the backing, but uh, as a beginner, you have to understand the chord procedure, process, concept, and all sorts of things before I can create uh, a chord. Because I, in one of my previous lessons, I did a neutral chord. So I have a magic chord. I term that uh, chord and I named the lesson learning the neutral chord. Yes. <laughs> It's only one chord, but it plays all the chords. When we play la, it fits it. When we play do, it fits it. All the chords do la, re, mi, fa, so. So if you know that chord, it's a magic. So you will not waste your time learning other chords. That's why sometimes I want you to follow the whole process rather than giving you one chord that plays all the time or one note that you can use to play all the other chords, making you lazy as well. So try your hands on this one. This is. I will name this one mute lesson one.
So we are going to break all these that we've done now into pieces. So it will be one, two, three, four, five, because I will do only the so, then I will do following the chords. I will do the third one that is playing like a solo, half technique, full mute technique, and mixed technique. So we have more than five lessons on the mute technique. So my friend chapters GH or Ben chapters, that is the uh, introduction to the lesson you've requested that you should do the mute guitar playing technique. So at, as for the first, please, I say the ring again. So don't press the guitar to the wall. Just let your finger be on the string just like that. Then you go to re mi fa so la ti do Show tomorrow I'm back for good uh, because uh, now it's giving me lashes that there is a whole lot of <laughs> uh, comments under the comment section so if you have requested a song you don't worry or if requested that I should do a lesson on any song don't worry uh, I'm back for good uh, because people are also complaining Oh, so you've taught Naya how to play the guitar. So she is now playing uh, on stage with uh, you people and Nana Tabrian. So, so the pressure is coming. If I do not take care, all my friends will be my enemies because of Naya playing bandstand. <laughs> so <laughs> you are all welcome. Uh, I'm back for good. Uh, if you have any comments, please, or any song, don't forget to bring it in. Mr. Kosida of Australia, uh, thank you very much. You are all welcome. I cannot mention it, but this lesson is dedicated to you, Ben Chapters. Bye bye.